Hi guys, so I've noticed a few people with um, a little bit of confusion about where things go in their notebook. So I wanted to kind of go through the notebook really quickly so that you could pause, look at it, make sure you have your stuff in the right place. Um, this is the cover to my notebook right here. The first page is gonna be the table, the first table of contents page. Then we have another table of contents page and then a third one. And then the first work page is one. Notice this is a left side page. Here's the spiral. This is a left side page if my notebook is open. This was the um, chart that we filled in with rational and irrational numbers. The next page at the top, the topic is rational numbers. This was um, unit one, lesson one. Your foldable is green and goes down the page this way. But it has this foldable about rational numbers on it. Page three was what we completed in class. Um, evaluating the absolute values, using counters, using a number line, all of that stuff. And I'll go and fill this in so you guys can get the answers if you need to. Um, and then page four, which is as far as you need to be right now, starts out at the top with adding integers with the same sign. So if you look at this side of your notebook, this side is talking about adding integers with counters. Here's positive integers, here's negative integers. Over here, using counters, positive integers, negative integers. The whole point of this is for you to have the examples on this side and the definitions and all the notes so that you can then work with me on this side. So I hope that clears this up a little bit and we can get your notebooks put in the right order. Um, so far you guys should have up to number four, up to page four done and then we'll continue on with five and six um, in another day or so. I hope that clears things up for you.